The Normandy group of foreign ministers have met to discuss the Russia-Ukraine conflict, with Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov demanding implementation of the Minsk agreements be delayed into 2016. We are behind in schedule, and ahead of us are a few difficult tasks. The difficult tasks are especially those which affect the so-called political process, meaning the preparations of elections in eastern Ukraine. In the Ostukraine. Steinmeier said it was not good enough that the Russian backed authorities in East Ukraine were depriving people living there of humanitarian assistance. We expressed our unhappiness that humanitarian organizations continue to have little access to eastern Ukraine and the Donbass region, with the exception of a few, such as the International Red Cross, which is admitted and can operate. But many other organizations so far are excluded. Arseniy Yatsenyuk, Ukraine's prime minister, expressed frustration that Russia had not complied with the Minsk protocol. Under the terms of the Minsk ceasefire deal, Russian troops must have left East Ukraine and Russia must allow Ukraine to regain control of its border before free and fair elections under Ukrainian law can be held. And the best way to hold free and fair elections is just to withdraw Russians and to pull back all Russian forces because we can't get any kind of free and fair elections under the barrel of Russian gun, you know? So... The ceasefire is not the implementation of the Minsk deal. The ceasefire is just the precondition for full implementation of the Minsk deal. Talks come as the ceasefire begins to look more and more vulnerable. Russian-backed militants are claiming the Ukrainian army fired grad rockets several times this week, and Ukraine has reported an increase in attacks against its defensive positions in recent days.